530, South Florida students taking a stand, dozens of them walking out of their high school because of health concerns. Some of them at South Plantation High School say the building has a serious mold problem and the district won't do anything about it. CBS 4's Ted Scouten was at the school in Plantation has reaction from the students and the school district. A couple dozen students walking out of class at South Plantation High School. They're protesting what they see as air quality issues. Um, today we are walking out due to the high levels of mold and carbon dioxide in our school. They've known about these for years but have done nothing to do about it until the walkout started. Protest organizer Chloe Delora showed us a picture of what she found inside the building. Some students say they have health concerns. We spend four years of our lives in the school every day except for weekends and you know, our health does matter. You know, coming and whether it's either little headaches or respiratory problems, it's a big problem in total. The school held a question and answer session Thursday. School administrators sent a voicemail to parents. It is my hope that many questions were answered and that all have a better understanding of our air quality situation. The principal also sent an email to parents and students explaining the air quality is very acceptable, but said, although we have had three reports of active mold growth on campus this past school year, the district and school-based staff worked in alignment with EPA protocols to investigate and remedy all three occurrences immediately. One student, who had permission to leave campus, told us she is not concerned. In the Q&A, they described to us in multiple ways of what they're doing to make sure that mold isn't happening, what they're doing to make sure that it is safe. But the school is old, and dust does accumulate. The district released a statement saying that they are monitoring the air quality specifically in one building. It goes on to say that they took some proactive measures already, and they plan to take more steps within the next two weeks to improve the air quality. In Plantation, Ted Scout, CBS 4 News.